Lean by the water, poke pill papa, put the best fighters on pill, pill, pills. I'm on that truck. Hey, Ready? what it is, man. You already know it's the kid. Lou, I'm counting them hundreds, no ones. And you already know I'm back with Dami Vuitton. She eating greedy on something, on some. What is that? <laughs> Mexican tacos. Mexican tacos. Steak tacos. Steak tacos. So good. Show them what you got in there. Show them what you got. I just got a taco, you guys. I mean, show them the meat. Like, show them the. Um, yeah, like she eating tacos. I like ate it all already. I got the green salsa and the red salsa. Yeah, Ver man. Verde and rojo. <laughs> and you already know what we reacted no, to, I man. It's about Spanish. to be. It was. I was on a trend, man. That's some weird shit. Uh, what humans will look like in a thousand years? I want to see uh, the fucking theory. This shit probably crazy. Uh, so I want to see it. I'm gonna make some. So let's get to it. Humans are still evolving. So where will evolution take us in a thousand years? Oh, I don't know. Chances are we'll be taller. Humans have already seen a boom in height over the last 130 years. Shit, I'm five, nah. In 1880, the average American male was five foot seven. Today, he's five foot ten. We may also merge with machines that can enhance our hearing, eyesight, health, and much more. Right now, there are hearing aids that let you record sounds, generate white noise, and even come with a built-in phone. Another example is a team out of the University of Oregon, which is developing bionic eyes that help the blind to see. But it's not impossible to imagine that this technology could become a tool for seeing what we currently consider invisible. Like different energies of light. Oh, that'd be too crazy. And x rays. I wouldn't want to do it all that. It'll eventually be a day where prosthetics are no longer just for the disabled. However, it's not just our outside appearance that will change. Our genes will also evolve on microscopic levels to aid our survival. For example, an Oxford led study discovered a group of HIV infected children in South Africa living healthy lives. It turns out they have a built in defense against HIV that prevents the virus from advancing to AIDS. And with gene editing tools like CRISPR, we may eventually control our oh, genes. No, we ain't put this shit makes me think about that. Like, how the fuck do kids. I hope they're not putting the kids with HIV in them, is they? Just to test them out for that. Mm -hmm. like, I hope not. I don't, let me not. I don't even want to get my mind in there. I don't even want to go there. I don't even want to go there. So we let me. We let me could get, have had them kind of conversation. Let me get back. I don't, want to, I don't want to get in there. Not today. But what y'all think? I just want to know what y'all think. I ain't going to get in all that. I don't ain't want no to. Ain't no telling what they That's are. why I said. I don't know. I don't even want to talk about it. Y'all let me know in the comments and we can talk about it there, okay? Because I'll. Let me go back to the video. DNA to the point where we make ourselves immune to disease and even reverse the but my dad of told me something like that before. Another way to jumpstart the human evolution. Let them talk about it. I want to see what they got to say. I want to see what they got to say. I want to see y'all got to Mars say. Mars receives 66% less sunlight than no. Earth, which can mean humans on Mars will evolve larger pupils that can absorb more light in order so to So they go on the humans on and Mars? And since Mars's gravitational pull is only 38% of Earth's, These people born on Mars on might actually be taller than anyone on Earth. In space, the fluid that separates our vertebrae expands, which led American aerospace engineer Robert Zubrin to suggest that Mars's low gravity could allow the human spine to elongate enough to add a few extra inches to our height. However, not even a move to Mars could spark the biggest change in human evolution that we may have coming for the next thousand years. Immortality. The Boy, get your required Boy, get your Okay, we done. That's it for the video. That was some bullshit. It, that was some BS. That was some bullshit. Off the. That was some bullshit. That was oh, some. My mama. Boy, that was, what's some bull in a shit at? That was some bullshit. We is not finna Boy, be I, don't, I had to stop watching this video. Hey, man, that's it for the video, man. Man, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, all on the score 1K. Follow me on full time. Y'all know what it is. It's gonna be right there. Yeah, man, damn, what they gonna start saying next? Spiders gonna be big as humans then? God damn, man, that's some bullshit, no man. Hey, man, y'all let, let me know what y'all gonna do next, man. That's some bullshit, though. All right, bet. Gone.